Hello everyone, welcome back to Slime Ranger. We finally got all the bug reports, so let's throw them right in. I did find a very consistent way to farm a bunch, so this actually isn't that bad. That was pretty bad, but they have an animation, I did not know that. Hmm, something's not right. Not right at all. The simulation has been running to predict the performance on the project. It's not matching the results at all. How is this possible? I run my simulations for everything, and they have uh, they have always made life easier. But what if they were wrong? What if what if some elephant element can exists that even I can simulate? I would need to create an entirely new formula to uh, compensate for this finding. And what would that mean for my previous simulations? All the experience and people I've passed on because I need to think about this. I've added my advanced drone blueprint to your lab. I should pr pr a chip prove useful to you according to my calculations. Well, I hope so at least. Now I... I need to think on this right away. But please collect more bug reports and slimulation. I'm very close to isolation, isolating the source of the bug. Is representable for production and for, produ for producing glitch flames. In return, I'll prepare a supplemental reward for you. Run diagnostics on simulation 392296. Username Vihom Prius. Password Smurf. I'm sorry, I slipped into the work into my work again without saying goodbye. Looking forward to your results. Goodbye. We need 600. 600 ain't bad. Like I said, I very consistently make over a hundred before I leave now. So that's pretty good. That's only like less than six runs. So now we have a bunch of those things again. I did want to make the portable water tap. I mean it because it was very useful. Put it around the drones probably, because the drones need some water. And also I need to figure out how to upgrade the drones advanced. I really need to just get rid of these. I'm gonna do that right now before I stop my er, start making. It was a fake, and they faked me out. They are good. Well, I guess if they fake me out, they can survive as long as they're not real. Okay, you are real. I saw you eat. I don't think I didn't see that. I was bamboozled again. Damn these slimes! I didn't know they could eat in their forms like that. Okay, so he seems to have two targets. Oh, that's a lot handier, I guess. Plorts, targets... Um, wait, that's not how the program works. Source, plort collector. I guess I'll also do plorts and free range. There. Activate. Uh, this one will be targets. It doesn't do food in general, which I think was the main issue. So food... Gardens, uh, corrals, auto feeders. And do the same for fruit. From gardens into auto feeders. So, this should actually make it so he will also pick up these things and put them in here, if I'm correct. Dude, what the hell did you do? This is a flipping mess. Well, he has free range now, so he can figure it out himself. Not my problem. Also, what the heck was I storing in here? Absolutely nothing. So I think this just literally gives us the entire lab. Which would be nice if we could see it. But certainly we guess we can't. But we will in a little bit. So I'm gonna be getting everything for this, and I'll be right back. Found a couple new uh, treasure pots as well. There's one back here. Let's see what it gives. Supply drop. Well, okay then. You can make a lot more of a science here. Also, this place. There we go. Field kit. So these are. We basically seen most of these already. They're kind of scattered around the lab area, but it's cool that we can actually put them elsewhere now. Okay then, we're back with the amount that we needed. Far, far more actually than the amount that we needed. Let's 
getting a lot easier to spot uh, the things for the slimes. Uh, hello, Beatrix. Good to see you again. Reports have been collect uh, the bug reports you have been collecting have been most illuminating. With your help, I've isolated the source of the glitch slimes and have a fix in place for removing them in order to continue my work on the slimulation. But first, I must tell you something. I've determined that this, uh, the simulation I've been running on your performance with this project isn't going, or it wasn't wrong at all. Though true, it proje uh, projected seemingly incorrect results, it was missing a crucial data point that the universe can surprise you. Until I observed your willingness to help me, a stranger really, and then your density within the sl uh, slimulation, I thought people and their abilities were much more predictable. But you've shown me that all the data in the world will still account for the spark in all the humans that motivate them. And this doesn't mean attempting to, pro to project and learn scientific process isn't worth pursuing. Quite the opposite, in fact. But it is important that we, that I, remember that the unexpected still has value. I, I regret that I have not seen this until now. Had I not simulated relationships and s simply let them surprise me, then perhaps I would have connected with a lot more people in my life. So with that in mind, I do hope you will continue to stay in touch, and to encourage this, I am giving you ownership of my workshop. Additionally, I have decided not to fix the bugs that created the glitch slimes. It would seem to me that this is very unexpected results is worth keeping, worth studying. So let's just see where this go where it goes. Who knows though, my simulation may not have, uh, may not be a perfect recreation of far far range. Yeah, I would say that, seeing as a lot of areas aren't really there, and they link kinda weird, but... Has he ever been out to Far Far Range, though? It uh, has its merits, because of it's so different. In that sense, I, it's a very exciting discovery. So please continue to collect bug reports, so that I may continue to study glitch slimes, and I will continue to give you a manifold cubes, or, or give you manifold cubes for your efforts. But also, perhaps we could occasionally just chat. You can pick the topic. I think I'd very much enjoy that. He didn't say goodbye again. God dang it. I thought it was going to be like one of those important moments for him. So now we should have... Yeah, we have access to this now. What's this? Can I stand? Does this do anything? Oh, this looks cool, it's all underwater. I hope they add, like, fish or something in there. It'd be amazing if they have fish slimes. Oh, those are places for building something. This is where we can choose and or choose color and buy some things, but I think I will stay with the rustic stuff for now. Oh, there's a ornament thing again. There is something over here, though. Oh my, look at that. Little mini moss blankets. And a pond. I do want to get the water though. When this actually grows the uh, things as well, that's pretty cool. Well, I think with that said, it is time to start collecting all the treasure pots at some point. I'll say at this point, if you've already seen that video, then I guess I've already done that, which hooray for me. But I'm gonna have to do it after this, and man, this guy escaped again. Stop escaping. But yes, yeah, sometimes updates like this have very irregular upload schedule. Like, you know, the general episodes generally get released a little later than some of the more guide like videos. I think that's okay. I might come back just after the, all the treasure pot stuff. Uh, mainly just to, uh, you know, check out a bunch of things, because there are some interesting things that we did get. And I do kind of want to see how overpowered some of these pads are, like the running one. Let's see if it can create a track or something with that. I do want to kind of test out some of the other utilities that we got. Like, what the heck is the purpose of having a portable scar Slime? Rather than the regular one? that we can make, because I think we already were able to make one. 
even though it's not in here, I guess. Yeah, it seems to have been across that just decorative. Well, they have so much decoration now. They may have, been, they may have just gotten to got rid of it, I guess. Because I don't see it in here anywhere, but I do know that there was one, because I had one. Well, anyway, also the veggie and the fruit bait, I want to see to, uh, how we could use that in a more in, uh, good way. But yeah, there will probably be more of these, and I want to see and check out all that stuff. So I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye, everyone.